And now the second part of this lecture, grammar, linking verbs, verbs of sense. Let's look at examples. The food smells delicious. So I can taste the food. I mean, I can uh, smell the food. It smells delicious. It feels soft. For example, the fabric feels soft. Or the skin, the skin feels soft. That means when I touch it, I feel that it is soft. It feels soft. So things, objects, can have these characteristics. They can be soft, they can be loud, they can be sweet, salty, dirty, clean. And in order to describe them, we use these verbs of sense, to smell, to feel, to look, to taste, to sound. Let's continue with examples. You look cold. You look, when I, when I look at you, you look like you're cold. You are shaking and shivering. You look cold. We can also say you look angry or you look upset. It's the look that you have. It's your characteristic. Another example, it tastes salty. For example, the food tastes salty. I taste it and it tastes salty. He sounds tired. Sound, to sound, check it in your dictionary. Something has a sound. So a person is talking, my friend is talking, and he sounds tired. I can hear it in his voice, in the way he speaks. You sound tired. We can also say, you look tired, but those are different senses. So one important thing to remember about these verbs of sense, or these linking verbs is that they are used in present simple only, only present simple. You cannot say the food is smelling or it is feeling or you're looking cold. No, past simple. These verbs are usually followed by an adjective. Here we go. We have the object, we have the verb, and then we have an adjective that describes the object, the subject of the sentence. Okay. 